But now I'm released to Maine. I'm going to go to Oakland where it's been two years. Two years. I'm excited to be back. I'm kind of nervous. I don't know who I'm going to see when I get there. But we'll find out. Spain was nice. I didn't really get any footage. I think I'll go for a lot more meeting up with a subscriber of mine and a fellow producer and music maker. So we might be making some music on there, which is really dope. Something I've been really wanting to do. If the audio is kind of messed up, I'm sorry. I think I have a problem with my mic. I don't know. We'll address that problem later. For now, it's time to go to the Checked in, got all that stuff. I actually met with my friend Dory from YouTube, Dude Beats, uh, which was pretty exciting. I didn't want to stick a camera in their face like on the first day, you know. But I met him and his wife, and I should be meeting up with him tomorrow to find it to like actually work on some music with somebody out here. So that's gonna be pretty cool. But um, yeah, I like the vibe of this hostel, man. They're having like a cookout outside or a barbecue of sorts. So I think I'm gonna go down there and uh, get some food, socialize, and I guess just, just see how things go. It's a really nice vibe in here, man. Very homey, very, very family-based. I, I like that. Uh, so yeah, we'll see. We'll see how things go. I'm feeling it. <laughs> yeah, I've already broken it now. Every day I keep breaking it. It's because I get so nervous in so many situations.
this on YouTube now? City. I'm not famous, dude. And it's very controversial because Irish people call it dairy. Like yeah. Protestant. I'm just gonna tell you a story. Okay. Um, so the story is, I met this guy in India, and he's one of these uh, kind of gypsies, these like traveling um, workers, travelers they call them in England, um, who just get by on random odd jobs. And uh, he okay, happened to start to tree planting. Mm -hmm. He planted yeah, half a million really trees like on his own. Half a million. Half a million trees. This is uh, enough to basically offset this hostel for the next like 200 years. Pretty cool. Moving the carbon from the air, you know. Mm -hmm. And he realized he's like, not only can people make money doing this, they can also make a change in the world. They can right. So offer the opportunity for people to travel green or um, work green, you know? And this is mind-blowing. He's been trying to explain it to me for five years. Mm -hmm. And I think I finally got it. That you can actually do something good for the people and good for the planet at the same time. And for me, this is revolutionary. And this is the, the matter of our times. And it's called Gone West. Gone West. And we're just a bunch of gypsies smoking cigarettes and eating strawberries. <laughs> but it's all a true story. That's sick. I'm working for them now, apparently. Are you serious? <laughs> okay. We met earlier today and I was telling them that I was looking for a job and that I speak German and English and uh -huh. that I would love to see the planet with them. Uh -huh. So, there you go. Wow. Traveling lifestyle. Traveling. Meeting new people. See, this is exactly why I picked this hostel to stay I wanted to stay somewhere different, somewhere that had like a social vibe, yeah, vibe but at the same time, kind of more on the chill side, because I've stayed at plenty of party hostels. Yeah. This is like exactly how I imagined, maybe even better. And I came on like the, the right day. We're having freaking cookouts and beers and ciders and people. It's just all kinds of all kinds of good energy, good vibes. Go, go go. I love that. I mean, the That's exactly it. It's yeah. good energy vibes. Yeah. It's not taking energy from anyone. Mm -hmm. It's just like it's putting it all together yeah, and like sharing it all in one. Yeah. To one messy space. Hola a todos. Buonasera, Catalunya. Buonasera. Bonsoir. If you guys haven't noticed already, there is a lady with a guitar on the stage. She tries And I'd like everyone to give it up for Kima. Kima! came on the perfect day, bro. Uh, first, just want to say, like, go Podstool. <laughs> go Podstool! This is one of the first songs I ever learned how to play.